All right, today we're going to uh, show you how to, how, or at least how we do it, how we look for rocks. And my daughter wanted to do an owl. So we're going to use this animal book. Okay, look for owls. Okay. So by this, we're going to look at these pages and see if we can find one that we like. This is a beautiful picture with the wing and all that. But the problem is, is when you make it on a rock, you have to fill in the void. So if anything, what we would do is we would do either the head and the body, maybe an oval-shaped rock, and then we can do that, or we could do a round rock and just do the face. Okay, so we're in the parking lot, and we're looking at the uh, rocks around us, and we're looking for the different shapes. And this is pretty much how we, how we find what we're going to work on. Sometimes we get inspired by a big rock, a little rock. What's this one, honey? I think this would be good because they have like a line at their head and then a round circle. Okay, we'll so. hold on to that one. We'll, we'll see as we do a collection of the rocks, we, we figure out which one we like. My daughter found, and uh, she does, uh, that's why I call her Girl of Vision. She really doesn't realize, uh, but she's very prophetic. And this is actually close to the uh, owl's wings position. So here we go. We got the uh, palm leaf down on the ground. We're going to stick the rocks on it and see which one is the best. Okay. That one's actually pretty good. Move it down a little bit. Let's see. Mm, maybe. It doesn't look long enough. Here's the last one. Okay. Ooh, that's a good one right there. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna wash the stuff because you don't know if a if a dog might have peed on it. I know that sounds kind of gross, but hey, it's true. We don't want any kind of disease. Here, honey, if you want to hold this, I'll go ahead and wash it. Or are you gonna wash it? Is that? Yeah, but we need we need to rub that with soap and stuff. Very easy to break. And a bacterial soap. Yeah, we don't want to get it too wet, and we don't want to. Here we go. Bird poop. Yuck. It's so dirty. Okay. Now we could just paint over it, but then again, just the thought of bird poop and you know uh, something yeah, something else on there. Yeah. Walking around and collecting stuff. This just stuff we're doing. We're gonna do wash. Always want to wash them. Always. And it's not because it's not because you're gonna handle it. Of course, when you paint over it, it's going to be fine, but you got to remember, you're going to be touching it as you're holding it and painting it. Okay, we got a little bit of this, 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 a little b